This video is brought to you by John Robson Guitar Tuition. If you enjoy the content, please consider supporting the channel by enrolling on a course, purchasing some guitar lessons or a t-shirt, or you can join my Patreon. Now, on with the show. Hello chaps, welcome once again to John Robson Guitar Tuition. As always, and especially at the moment, I do hope you're well. Now then, I don't know how this is coming across on camera, but if you look closely, you'll see I am a little bit bristly. And that's not because of any kind of lockdown beard or anything like that. What happened was, we we are living through times where not all of the shelves in the supermarket are full. And um, I couldn't get my usual brand of razors. So I bought another brand, uh, same company that make cheap disposable ballpoint pens and cigarette lighters you know the ones and um anyway pretty much nearly decapitated myself with it uh, I, i'm not telling you the back of my head is like an accident in a butcher's shop window uh, my pillowcase looks like something from an episode of csi so i'm having to let this grow a little bit whilst uh, i heal my gaping wounds and um you know before i take a blade to it again so that's the uh, the reason for the whiskers Anyway, uh, to the topic of the day, I used to have a t-shirt that said this on it. Uh, I have enough guitars, said no one ever. And that's pretty much the case, isn't it, usually? Ask any guitarist how many guitars they need and they'll always tell you one more. And um, I'm working ridiculously long hours at the moment. Um, fortunately, my tuition business is holding up uh, through these times. And um, I'm, I'm up at the desk on a morning, uh, 6.30, 7 o'clock, uh, teaching some of the people in like Australia and New Zealand that I, that I work with, uh, all the way through to like, you know, kind of 9 p.m. on an evening some days. Um, and then there's making these videos and then there's transcribing stuff and putting content up on Patreon and, um, you know, some of the music commissions that I do and writing courses and stuff. So busy, busy, busy at the moment. And, um, my missus said to me the other day, she says, you know, you're working at, you're working really hard at the moment. Um, when all this madness is over, get yourself a new guitar, treat yourself. Oh, wow. Okay, <laughs> a free pass out from the boss. Yeah, I'll t I'll take it up on that, love. Um, so straight away, of course, get me phone out on the tour man, and I'm looking at uh, different guitars, and nah, nah, mm, nah. And I realised I wasn't being picky. I realised I wasn't just being overly choosy and um, finicky about it. It's just that. Well, let me put it this way. If I want a classic bridge humbucker raunchy rock sound, I got that covered. <laughs> if I want a classic sort of Telecaster bridge pickup tone, that's covered as well. <laughs> More than once. And again. If I want like a, a warm but clean and transparent um, clean sound for doing chords and, and general accompaniment, yeah, I'm on top of that. If I want that classic, quacky, strat sound, position two, position four on the switch, yeah, that's covered. More than once. And what about that, um, you know, that, Texas Blues Strat Single Coil Neck Pickup Sound. One of my favourite sounds of all time. Yep, that's covered. Once 
once again, more than once. Or what about that fluty, creamy neck humbucker tone? Yeah, got that box ticked as well. So, as I was flicking through all of these guitars that I was potentially going to treat myself to, I just realised... I've already got something that does that. I've already got something that does that. Oh, yeah, and I've already got that sound in my toolbox. So, I think the T-shirt is wrong. I do have enough guitars. Uh, there is genuinely nothing else out there that is making me itchy to spend money and get the credit card out. At the moment, certainly, I would rather just have the money in the bank than um, have another guitar hanging on the wall. And, yeah, it's, I know. I'm a guitarist, and I'm saying I don't want any more guitars. What on earth is wrong with the world? But let me know how you guys feel. Is this the same with you? Are you itching to buy something new, or are you content with your lot in the same way that I am? It's an interesting little thing to talk about, I think. Anyway, that's just the end of it for today. Just a short little video, just putting this out there. I just want to uh, see what you lot think about um, this issue of how many guitars is enough. Uh, you'll have noticed there uh, that one of the guitars, the uh, the Strat copy I was playing, has the Fret Zealot on it and uh, fantastic tuition aid. And if you want one, you can get one for free almost. Uh, just make a donation to Zoe's Place Baby Hospice, which is a charity in Middlesbrough that does loads of great work with children uh, that got very serious uh, diseases and uh, very seriously ill make a donation to them link is in the description and screenshot your receipt send it to me at this email address and you're entered into the draw to win a fret zealot uh, basically a couple of my courses are available on the fret zealot app um, so to celebrate that we're doing a bit of a giveaway uh, I'll be picking a winner on the 7th of May and announcing who that is very shortly after that. And if you don't win, don't worry, you can still get one a little bit cheaper by using this discount code you can see on screen right now. Use the link in the description to make your purchase, use the discount code, you'll get a little bit of money knocked off thanks to yours truly. You're welcome. And that's pretty much it for today. Just uh, a reminder not to uh, miss the 5pm five, the 5 Friday live stream tomorrow. Um, we're going to have a beer and a chat and a laugh. It's great fun. Usually is. Usually kind of sit there putting the world to rights like a bunch of uh, grumpy old curmudgeons for an hour or so whilst having a, a few drinks. And it's immense fun. So be there or be square as they say um and that's it for today folks thanks for watching thanks for your time leave your comments below about what you think about how many guitars is enough and i will see you all again next time around stay safe guys bye for now